Hey, what's up guys? We are back with a brand new video today. We are doing another Slime Rancher video. In today's video, guys, we are back for episode 5 of... Yeah, 5. 5 of Slime? Slime? Blah, blah, blah. Wow. You can already tell how this episode's gonna go. Um, but anyways, what we are doing right now is we are taking a look at some of the upgrades we got in the last episode, which you might be like, you didn't get any upgrades in the last episode. Well... Apparently, I actually did, but I think I cut them out. So, there is some stuff that happened. We got this, which is basically a toy machine, almost. Just a nice touch to the game, I guess. I think we uh, upgraded the house a little bit, too. So, you can basically get different kinds of, um, like, colors and stuff. Uh, I like the class. Well, let me try that. Um, that's not bad. I think I just like the classic, though. And what's all this stuff? Tech. What's um. I'm not ex. Wait a minute. Tech. Okay, I'm not exactly sure what that is, uh, but we'll get into that a little bit later. I think we may have upgraded these paths. It looks like I did. Um, I may have done that in the one of the previous episodes, though. But yeah, basically the ranch has just gotten upgraded a little bit. So if things are just slightly different, I do apologize uh, that I did cut that out. I didn't mean to. Oh, and this is the other thing that happened off camera. Um, Ogden Ortiz. Uh, let's go ahead and read all this. I don't think I read any of this, so let's go ahead and read it. You seem to be making a name for yourself, and I like to, and I like your style. So let me cut right to the chase. I'd like to offer you a job doing a little side work for me. I've got a chunk of land on the outskirts of my property that has access to a place called the Wilds, a land of primitive feral slimes, dangerous as all get out, but also home to a delicious rare fruit that I love. If you're up for a challenge, come on down to a little retreat of mine near the wilds, and I and learn more. I found a derelict teleporter on your network that I've activated on your ranch. It'll take you right to it. Hope to see you there. Ogden Orchards. Okay, so we're gonna check that out in the morning. Let's go ahead and sleep until morning. Okay, so the main things we're gonna be doing today are obviously going to that place. Uh, I want to upgrade the ranch on camera this time a little bit more. I want to upgrade our backpack. Uh, maybe do a little bit more of the 7Z Rewards Club. And uh, the main thing is uh, what I want to do is get this science lab over here and uh, basically what this is is this allows you to get all these different kinds of like things and stuff for your slimes that help upgrade the ranch a lot I'm not exactly sure about all the details of it but I know it helps a lot uh, with a bunch of different things it's 10,000 so I've been saving up for that after we visit uh, Ogden Ortiz whatever his name is uh, we're gonna come back and we're gonna check that place out okay all the slimes seem pretty happy the one thing I do want to do is I want to buy something for them. Um, I think we're gonna go with that. Where'd it go? There it is. And I think they will play with it, I believe. But um, I'm gonna let them figure that out for a little bit. Yeah, it looks like they play with it a little bit. Uh, we might get a little bit of footage of them later, see if we can get um, catch them in the act of actually playing with the beach ball. But for now, we're just going to go over to Ogden Ortiz's place, and this is kind of what I expected it to be like, actually. Can't go in there. Ooh, we can... I'm not really sure what this stuff is. Oh, I know what this is. So we can, like, basically customize our backpack as well. So, see, we can get the that changed, and I'm not sure what the tech does, but um, I guess that changes something. Maybe like the color of the slime cages or whatever. Here we go. Alright, what does he want? Hiya Beatrix, um, just remember the character in this game that I'm playing is a girl. Uh, you can't actually change the genders, so. Um, anyways, thanks for coming down to my retreat and hearing me out on my offer. So let's get right down to business. I built this place years ago as a little vacation spot for myself. Later on I realized that it was, that its neighbors that it neighbors a cluster of islands filled with primitive saber slimes. I called these islands the wilds, and after exploring them, they revealed their true secret, the rare kookabadoa fruit. I'm just gonna read the rest of this real quick, and then uh, I will talk to you guys after that and fill you in. Okay, so basically he wants this fruit that's kind of almost guarded by these feral slimes, and um, wait a minute, where do we go? This way. And uh, 
he wants us to get him, and he'll reward us with, like, tofu or something. I don't really know. But basically, we're gonna go and get it. Oh, my goodness. Oh, jeez. I feel like I should have upgraded my energy potential before this. These are pogo fruits. And they don't eat them. Okay, it looks like we have to go up here. I'm surprised I haven't been killed yet, but... Oh, uh, wait a minute. Is that one? Okay, cool. This looks very evil. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! That scared the living daylights out of me. Oh, this looks nice. Oh my gosh! This is what I expected the feral slimes to look like. Kind of like the hunter slimes. I don't know if they, like, eat anything. Like, I can sacrifice... What is... Whoa, 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 Okay, what was that thing? I'm really curious now. And also, there's a lot to explore here. I'm kind of surprised. I thought this was going to be just, like, one little place. I thought it was more so going to be, like, I kind of had to go through all these slimes to find, like, one great fruit. But apparently, like, for every three I get, he's going to give me, like, three tofu or whatever. It's really weird. This isn't quite as bad as I thought it'd be, but it's still pretty dangerous. Alright, let's head up this way. I like the music here, too. Okay. Ow, ow. Oh my gosh, they take a lot of health. Okay, I'm running, I'm running, I'm running. <laughs> I really want to know what those things are, though. They almost look like coconuts mixed with the kookabadoa. And I said that right, I think. That would be a first for this game. Okay, I'm just taking this. Alright, whatever it is, I can't do anything with it. Is there any way I can, like, saber slime? What? Dude! Saber plort. That's what that. That's what that. Oh my gosh! I need to run. That's what that was though. I'd seen like some. Um, I'd seen some cool uh, plorts in the plort market. I wondered what they were, but I guess we can take some things home with us. Apparently. All right. Well, now I've got a lot of incentive not to die. Okay. There we go. We can get home from here. Yes. Not bad. Okay. If. Oh, okay, if we get, like, a garden recipe... Wait, if we give him 75, he'll give us some kind of, like, a secret garden recipe. And if we give him three, he'll give us one tofu. What does this even do? Never quite fills you up. I don't even know what that's for, but okay. Oh, gosh, that's a lot of tofu. <laughs> Alright. And let's just head back and see what we can do with this stuff. Oh, wait a minute. We can look it up on the Slimepedia. Spice can be only fed to slime. Hmm. Alright, well, I'm definitely gonna keep that. That's interesting. That must have come with the, um, update a long time ago. Because I had never heard of that. Alright, and I'm assuming we can feed, um... I mean, not feed. Sell Saber Plorts. Not bad money for them, actually. Okay, I'll take it. Um, 7Z Rewards Club. Advanced Slime Toys. That's 5,000. Alright, we might upgrade that today. Uh, the main thing is the science lab. Right, let's just go ahead and do it before something else comes up that I need to do. Purchase. There we go. You've unlocked the science lab, a special ranch expansion that will allow you to create gadgets using Slime Science. Slime Science. Wow. Slime Science. This barn has all the equipment you'll need to begin crafting gadgets using sli Slime Science. Gadgets include useful utilities to aid in exploring defensive turrets, decorations, and more. Okay, so apparently we need- ooh, even saber plorts. Gold plorts. Wow. Like I've said many a time, I've seen uh, some series on this, so basically you need to put in certain plorts for certain things. So, right now, how do we unlock things? This. This is where we- like design stuff, I guess. Okay, novice pump, novice pyre allows you to collect resources from wild bees. And oh, the drone. Okay, so this is I know this came out in a later update, but this is basically a helper bot that can be programmed to buzz around your ranch and perform a variety of tasks. So this is almost like a robot, you know, you can get them to feed your slimes or do certain things. You can get like a certain amount, all kinds of cool stuff. So I definitely want to get that. A special snare that captures a Gordo slime, bait it with food and wait. Definitely want to get that. I kind of want to wait on the drone because I feel like that's kind of 
a little overkill for right now because we don't really have that many slimes or anything. We don't really need it. So it looks like we put stuff in there. Okay. Alright, let's just go pick up about 20, 20 of each plort. Set it in there. And then we will get a bunch of um, stuff made, I guess. This is pretty cool, actually. Alright, let's just get, like I said, 20 of each plort. Well, or should we go for 30? Why not? Let's go for 30. We're going to need it eventually anyways. And you can unlock more things to build in the future and stuff. I know that for sure. So that'll be cool. There's all kinds of different things you can get. There's a lot of spots over there you can also build, like, corrals and stuff, and uh, more gardens and stuff like that. So I kind of want to figure out what we're going to put over there. Um, I guess in the next episode we might try and explore the, um, this place. Because I think a lot of these come from the same place. So we're going to try and explore that in the next episode. We might wait one episode, though, because I think, you know, we've, we're have we getting kind of close to discovering everything. I don't want to discover everything just yet. kind of want to wait for a little bit more surprise. Oh, what's up this way? Oh, this was the um, little tunnel down to the grotto, I believe. Yeah, so we can go down here and then, yep, that's pretty cool. So there's all kinds of stuff we can do here. Um, but let's go ahead and put this stuff in. Alright, let's just put all these in here. So now, can we make any of these yet? Nope. Oh, we can make the Apiri. Apiri? Apiri. If we get honey plorts. So let's go and do that real quick. 60 honey plorts. Oh my gosh. The only thing is, this is going to slow down our um, money making process a little too much. But that's not a big deal. I am excited for these other slimes, too, because that means we can make even more stuff. And that's probably why we haven't unlocked a lot of this stuff yet, is because we need more slimes to do it, so. Alright, well, let's go ahead and get the, uh, Peary, and then we'll set that down. Yes. How many can we make? Oh, yeah, but now we're gonna need more for other things. Alright, so, now, what do we do? Ah. T. Okay. Where do we want to... Let's set them over here. Install. Okay, and that'll go for 12 minutes. Install. 12 minutes. And install. Okay. There we go. And so that'll... I guess get... B stuff. I guess we need that to build... I don't actually know what we need it to build. Yeah, right here. Buzz wax. Stuff like that. Okay. Well, obviously, I'm going to have to do a lot of off-camera work for this. Okay, guys, we got 12 puddle plorts to put in, and then we'll have all the plorts. But, while I was doing that off-camera work um, to get all these plorts ready for building stuff, I got the treasure cracker thing. So, basically, what that is is, you know all this little, like, kind of, I don't know, like, I don't know how to describe them. They're basically treasure pods, is what they call them, and they're scattered all around the world, and I've been seeing them so much, and I know, like, if you open them up, you'll get, like, all these cool things, but I haven't been able to unlock them until now, and I'm sure it has something to do with, like, the, that thing over there, so, after we go to sleep, because it's, like, you know, really late, uh, we're gonna go ahead and check that out, and then we're gonna go ahead and build some more stuff. Okay, let's go ahead and check this out real quick. Treasure Cracker. 4,500, okay. I do want to upgrade all that stuff while we're at it. And that as well. Okay. But now we're kind of dirt poor. <laughs> Are these things done? I think so. Yep. These are novice drills, so I don't think we get like as much from them. Lots of buzz wax. That's good. More buzz wax. And that's it. Okay. Um, just put them in here, I guess. So now we can make... What's that give us? Alright, I'm gonna get one of those. One of those. What else? Let's just go for another drill. Um, let's go ahead and set these down. T. Install. 
install. And I believe if you put these in like different places, like different environments, they'll give you different things. So that's pretty cool. Um, and we will check that out. I'm probably going to do a lot of off-camera stuff. Science class passed. Great. I'm probably going to do a lot of off-camera stuff, though, like I said. And uh, we'll kind of get a lot of stuff ready for the next episode. And we can build even more stuff for um, the drills and all kinds of things like that. Now, what was I going to do? I was going to... Right, I was going to go find a treasure pot, actually. Alright, was there a treasure pot over here? I know, I'm sounding really crazy right now, but it's such a thing. There are treasure pods. Just don't know where they are. There we go. Alright. We got the... Ooh. Yeah, it's a blueprint thing. So that looks like a decorative... The coral grass patch. So I think there's some more over here. I think there's also like different levels. So we can't unlock all of them like right now. There should be... Here we go. Uh, what do we got? The amber slime lamp. Now that looks pretty cool actually. Alright, that looks like one there. Yeah, we need we need a more advanced one. Yeah, I don't see any more, but we can get those um, another time. I just kind of wanted to demonstrate that mostly. Let's head back over here and see if there's anything else we can get. I think the main thing we're going to need a lot of is pink plort and stuff. All we might do is mix the pink slimes we have with another slime, and then we'll get the their favorite food from them, and then we can get a lot of pink slime plorts. Because, you know, the... If they have a favorite food, uh, then they'll drop like double the plorts if you feed them their favorite food. The pink slimes don't actually have one, but if you mix them with a slime that does have a favorite food, then you'll also get two pink slime plorts. It's very complicated, but whatever. Oh, yes, now we've got space for 40. Alright, there we go. But yeah, I, I was about to say, I wish we had more space for um, plorts and stuff in our inventory, but now we've got 40. I think you can upgrade to 50 at some point, but I could be wrong. I really want to make that drone, but I'm going to wait. I would like this too, though. We might, if we get into the jelly stone and the primordy, primordy, whatever, oil, and we'll be set. What else can we unlock here? A set of that might actually be good. I'm going to go ahead and get that. Teleporters. Warp tech. We're not getting that anytime soon. Look at all the stuff we need for that. Alright, what else can we unlock? Hydro turret. That looks pretty useful. Um, what does this do? A set of two gadgets that allows you to remotely transfer resources. Yes. <laughs> Definitely. I've been wanting one of those for a while. That's pretty cool. That looks expensive. What else? Can we make that? No, of course not. That, no. We're going to have to go to a lot of different locations. Uh, we'll probably do some of this in the next episode. I'm, I'm pretty excited about this. I'm not really a huge science guy normally, um, honestly, but this does look pretty nice. We're not going to wait for these to finish. Uh, I'll probably just let these finish off camera. But I do want to see what the other ones produce, so we'll wait for those. Real quick, before the end of the video, I do want to go over and take a look at the 7Z Rewards Club, and then we'll go over it, see what the drills and pumps have for us, and then we'll probably stop the episode there. Alright, let's go ahead and purchase that. Ooh. That looks really nice, too. Is there a way we can get, like, some extra money fast? And this will give us the money we need, I think. I don't even know what all that's going to do. Grotto upgrade. That sounds cool. Well, we've definitely got a lot of money to earn off camera now, but we will do that. So, what's the ginger snap? That sounds cool. Not a huge difference, actually. Peapod. I'm gonna get, like, kind of a blue themed. That's not bad. Um, I think I'm just so used to the classic by now, though. Like, I, I, really, I really don't want to switch. Because if I switch that, then I'm gonna have to switch with my backpack as well. It, it has to match. I mean course. Alright, real quick while we're waiting on the drills and pumps, let's just go ahead and sell this guy some chickens. And there we go. Looks like we got some rad ports and pogo fruit. Okay, cool. Let's go put all this in our silo and then we'll take the rad ports over to the science lab. 
But yeah, this definitely opens up a lot more options. So in the next episode, we'll probably get more things from the science lab. We'll probably go to the new place where we can get a bunch more slimes. And then I guess we'll just try and upgrade the place as much as possible. I'm not sure where we'll go from there. We've made a lot of progress really fast. Okay, we got some jelly stone. Ah, okay, and what do we get from here? More jelly stone, ooh. And what's that? Slime fossil. Okay, we might actually be able to craft something now. Wait, can we? I think we, we don't have enough, okay. I am actually gonna wait on that because I kinda wanna, well, unless there's something else we can craft. No. All right, let's wait on the primity, primity, whatever, oil. We'll wait on that, and then we'll craft ourselves a novice Gordo Snare. Glad I came over here. What do we get? Oh! I didn't know it. Oh, okay. Oh, wait a minute. The strange diamond. The, uh, that's what we needed to craft the teleporter, I believe. Strange diamond. We need five hexacomb. We, yeah, we got deep brine. Okay, uh, I kind of want to go and get some other stuff now from those, but I am going to hold off. Yeah, we just need two more of those, five more deep brine. Anyways, I'm going to stop talking. I'm going to let those go, and I will talk to you guys once they are ready. Okay, these things are all ready. Please give me some oil. Okay, wait a minute, they don't come from these. It's these, right? Yeah, there we go. Oh my gosh, perfect. Eight, wow. All right, we'll just go ahead and finish emptying these out. We got some more deep brine. No, that's spiral steam. Okay. I didn't think we could actually get that much from here. I thought we had to go to a lot of different places, but not too bad. Can we get that now? Yes. All right, there we go. Now, where do we want to put it? Um, yeah, let's put it somewhere over here, I guess. Maybe... Here. Install. Okay, there we go. And I guess we just have to wait for a Gordo. Wait a minute, do we have to put some kind of food on it or something? Yeah, okay, there we go. Yeah, I guess we'll leave it at that. So, we've made a lot of progress in this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to leave a like down below or subscribe or leave a nice constructive comment. But that is it for me this video. In the next episode, we'll be doing more science stuff and maybe some more exploring. But that is it for me this video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye for now.